Hey guys, welcome to another LEGO set review. Today we're going to go over Thorn Rex. The set was released in the year 2012, contains about 45 pieces if I'm not mistaken, and the time of release was approximately $8. Alright, so let's get to uh, Thorn Rex right over here. Now, it's unfortunate that he, of course, like the other two heroes and vi villains out of the nine, did not make an appearance of the episode of the Hero Factory TV series of that being Breakout. Which is kind of unfortunate. I would have loved to see Breeze again. Especially when her last appearance bef before the Brain Attack episode, they had her in the 2.0. So, you know, Surge and Breeze took a break from the 3.0. And, uh, yeah. Look up to the pros. I like the black, the light blue, or the cyan blue, and the orange. It's a pretty good mixture. And I like how they made him insect-like. I like the wings right here, which are the same ones that uh, the Bionicle 2008 Makuta Gorast uses. And, uh, in fact, this set is kind of some way similar to, uh, Gorast. Knowing that they're both insects. And, uh, I like they utilize the Quasa Spike for the Stinger, just like with Black Phantom for the his horns. I thought that was a pretty nice touch. And the cons, well, there's not much I have to say other than the fact that if you position it a certain way this can bend and it could ruin the piece and the fact that this right here is really opened you know there's not much to it but and if you flip him on the back here well I mean like it doesn't really bother me this time that they didn't bother to cover up this part I mean he is an insect after all so he's gonna stay like this pose so that's pretty much it uh do i recommend you get the set yes and uh that's gonna be it for the video guys as always don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys next video peace